We're in week 14. Coming off a loss to the Houston Texans. This is the first gameplay on the PS5 for myself. Played a game before, but like for this franchise, I really tried to get it done before next gen got out like at least one season but for me it was so tough playing ps4 games when i have a ps5 and i could play the ps5 games knowing that this game was going to come out in a few weeks anyways or this version of the game so we're we're finally back on the grind for this or we are eight and four we're going to go up against the five and seven raiders in las vegas so i get to see their stadium for the first time kind of went over this in the last video but here's the projected playoff bracket we are the number one seed at the moment i believe we're tied with the new england patriots so we need to try to win out the rest of these games message from a breakout player help a player upgrade his dev trait malik hooker is looking to upgrade his dev trait this week we need to hold the Raiders to less than 150 pass yards or get Malik Hooker two interceptions, force fumbles, tackles for losses, or sacks. So no superstar X factors in this game. The Raiders do have three superstars though with Rodney Hudson, Josh Jacobs, more powerful truck animations, and Trent Brown. So two linemen, man, they run the ball against us. I think they're gonna have a good time. We're going to start off with the Jonathan Taylor run. See if we can get some push here. We're cutting it back. Ooh, Taylor gets caught at the line, but he does get three yards. Ooh, we're going to go mesh right here. T.Y. Hilton going down the field. This Raiders field's very bright on the eyes. Not going to lie. They're sending the heat. We get it off to Taylor Gabriel. Oh, he can't outrun number 25. There was no one in sight. Here we go. Pitch to Jonathan Taylor to the left. Quentin Nelson gets the block. JT gets the first down. Gets a juke. Oh, he was still up. But the second guy that got there got us down. For, but still, we get a first down. Ray Burden. So we have the drag. Gabriel could be wide open. He could burn his guy. Stump this off. We get it to Paris Campbell, who gets us a first down. Look at that. There's a flag. Hopefully it's not a holding call. Personal foul, roughing the passer. We're going to be at the seven. Lamarcus Joyner with the roughing the passer call. We're in within the 10. JT gained the carry. He got sucked into a tackle right there. John the Taylor, wide open hole right here. All of a sudden, wide open hole. Should have been probably a one on one with 44, but it looked like it was going to be that guy over the top. And then John the Taylor all of a sudden just gets sucked into 73. We're going to go at it again to JT, trying to get him in the end zone once again. And Jonathan Taylor's in. His first next gen touchdown. Graphics definitely look a little cleaner. But you like to see that. We're gonna be on Wilson. The boys are in man. They're running the ball again. Jacobs gets some four yards right here. It's gonna be a third and five. No, the running back's open. Oh! <gasps> Derek Carr makes a bad read and we're going to get the football back. Fourth and one. He had the running back wide open over the middle of the field. And he failed to make the read. Let's go, JT. Let's go, JT. Gets us three yards. John the Taylor's already up to 30 yards in the game. We're still here in the first. Third and six. I'm going to look for him to catch this pass right here. Let's go. John the Taylor with the reception. Really? He got caught right there. I thought he was gone. All right, TY. If it's man, potentially he could burn. Harris Campbell is probably going to be the look for us, though. T. Why? 
Hilton makes the catch and we're down to the one. Yo, let's see if Jonathan Taylor can get in the end zone for the second time today. And he can. We, we're about to go up 14 nothing here in the first. Jonathan Taylor, second touchdown of the day. Oh, I read that. Make the tackle. Could not get back to that in time. Nelson Aguilar. Second and 10. We're going to send a little blitz right here. We're going to be in Bobby Okariki. We're going to let Griffin get in on Derek Carr. There's a flag on the play. I assume it's going to be holding. Let's see what the call is. Holding offense. Yes, yeah, so it is a holding call. That first down is no more. Now it's second and 20. Pretty bad holding call right there, especially with the amount of yardage they got. They're going deep. He was butt naked. Cover four. And he was just wide open. That's why I hate running cover four. I feel like it just gets burned a lot. First and 10 though, inside the red zone. And they just complete it to number 15. Nelson Aguilar. We're only rushing three. Oh, Derek Carr can't make the completion. The Raiders are gonna have to settle for three. Harris Campbell. I guess he's the main target. Taylor Gabriel, T.Y. Hilton. Stump it off to uh, Trey Burden. If they were running man, someone was going to be wide open. I love running that play. Second and two, we're going to try and go for the first down right here. And we're going to get it. Jonathan Taylor gets us the two and more. He gets us five yards. I hate how the coach suggestions are like, you know what? Just run the cheesiest plays alive. We're going to block Jonathan Taylor. Come on, run man. Yes. Run man. T. Y. Hilton is gone. T. Y. Hilton finds the end zone for the first time today. 1,250 yards receiving on the year we're about to go to up 21 to 3 the last time i ran that play i i clearly said that's exactly what happened if they ran man ty hilton he's just amazing with his route running he has the speed to break away from people we're gonna send a little blitz kind of expect this team not to run the ball as much especially being down all right let's make a tackle being down by 18 points here in the second. Oh! You sin with the pick! We're, we're right back on offense. Derek Carr turns over the ball. Just passes off to Gabriel. He had so much separation there. We get out of bounds. Up to the 28 yard line. Phil Rivers already has 200 passing yards. We're only in the second quarter. Let's dump this off again. Trey Burden, he gets us six yards on that catch. We'll keep him in the game. I don't think he's going to be in too many plays regardless. Third and four. Could look at TY. I think Gabriel or Campbell are going to be the more likely suspects, though. Especially Campbell. Campbell makes the catch. We get the first. We're at the 14 this ball up the middle there we go there's a hole Jonathan Taylor gets us a first down and we're down to the three he already has two touchdowns today he's gonna be looking for his third right here JT is always the option within the five and he gets in the end zone for the third time today he's, he's gonna break the, the touchdown record no doubt the amount of times we get down to the within the five yard line I just say F it and run it with JT way too many Derek Carr needs to try and make something happen. They need points. Oh, we're going to blitz five right here. We're going to be on Griffin, who 
on the running back running back isn't doing much rugs is wide open but he just dumps it off to uh, jacobs for like no yardage play the sticks right here no first down no first down we're there we're there we're there no completion it's fourth down and we get the ball back yet again let's see if ty hilton can get it open over the top jt gets some separation oh you avoided that tackle already at the 35 yard line let's see what ty oh campbell campbell oh we're down to the four it looks like jonathan taylor is about to get another touchdown here like the amount of times we get within the four yard line or within the five is way too many all right the signature play the full back dive get in there 28 to 3 we are going for this we're going right back to the fullback dive if they want to be at the one they could be at the one but john and taylor gonna try and get in the end zone here and he does for the fourth time today <laughs> that celebration is cool we're gonna send a little blitz right here show it oh big hit on waller over three hard flat oh i'm on the line i'm stuck on the lineman see if we can get some pressure on Derek carr he hits number 89 they're down to the 48 i was not gonna run man coverage with five five out like that i think they're gonna get above 150 yards passing be nice for Lily Cooker to have like a pick or force fumble or we're here. Oh, I guess we're not here. They're gonna go for a field goal. That's all they could get here. The end the half. You get the ball back at the second or in the second half, so I guess it's not terrible. Ooh. Number 15, Nelson Aguilar is wide open. There's a flag on the play. He touched the ball after coming back inbounds. It was going to be a penalty. It's just going to be third and six. It's, it, nothing changes. At the end of the semester, feeling's always a good one. I think I had pass interference or like illegal contact on defense. Could be wrong. Yeah. They complete the pass regardless covering a spot someone over the middle of the field they're running the ball we get a tackle not a tackle for loss give me tough game malik like two picks and stuff give me on shakim trying to prevent this first down from happening there's a guy coming across the middle we can't make a play Derek carr completes the pass like what are we doing that catch should have not been like made at all yeah he's definitely not coming back to the bears one thing for sure we're over the middle of the field 13's naked for a touchdown is that hunter renfro hunter renfro gets a touchdown for the las vegas raiders their first of the night I don't know why I keep saying night because there's only one night football game on Sundays. We're gonna try to burn some decent clock on this drive. Jonathan Taylor he gets us four yards, up to 69 on the night. 20 rushes. So his, his totals don't look too great. A few of his carries, four of his carries came within like two yards. So that doesn't help his average at all let's go let's go quentin i need you to run upfield and make a block we're gonna go quick slants here burden's gonna be on a streak in case someone can't keep up with him it's gonna ty hilton easy catch bill Rivers is 14 of 16. all right ty hilton he's r1 on this play
Terrible. Terrible read. <laughs> I easily had Paris Campbell underneath, and I was like, you know what? Let's just see what can happen. We turn over the ball for the first time. We're in Darren Waller. He's an easy. More with a pick. What kind of read was that? So are the last two drives combined for both teams and in a in an interception it's just a dumb read i was getting pressured we just got some yards whatever we're up 22 points the clock is ticking i could knock it in the backfield for the sack justin houston could though under oh Josh Jacobs steps out of bounds. Did he get the first? He did not. He had so much space and he stepped out of bounds. Gonna pass it off to Gabriel. He gets hit as he makes the catch, though. It's a new engine. AT, no one, no one advanced. We double teamed the first defensive lineman. Quinton Nelson failed to advance to the next level. They're gonna just have us run the ball quite a bit right here 278 yards for the, the raiders and they've barely put up points to show for it cut this back jt he breaks one tackle and then there's a swarm of guys on his back he's up to almost 100 yards this game after this though i'm gonna definitely make sure to do that jt it's us four yards on that carry we get a first also i don't know if you guys have noticed but the lighting has changed drastically compared to the first quarter of this game which is good also the the guy who just made that tackle insane oh and he's gonna get a run right here he fumbles the ball we get the ball back no way that guy should have been blocked Let's see if the raiders can convert this here we're playing underneath. Aguilar's doesn't even try to fight for the ball. He, he puts a block as if like someone else was there trying to get make that catch. Fourth and one. Should be an easy conversion. One yard. Oh, they're running the ball. No one's there. The oh, I just missed the tackle with Griffin. Man. That was bad. Sure. <laughs> we'll just play three man deep. We'll just allow a bunch of yards. That's that's completely fine. Because they're they're down twenty two points. They need to score. Because every time we make a tackle in the open field and they don't score a touchdown, it's good for us. Screen. Oh, we're too slow to make the tackle. Bach just keeps ticking and ticking and ticking and ticking. Number 11 with the catch. Big hit from Griffin. Bach is ticking and ticking and ticking. Oh, they cannot convert the fourth down. And that's going to do it. We're gonna take a couple runs slash kneel downs and end this ball game. Get to the edge. Ooh, we get a juke and the first. Taylor's gonna end up with 124 yards and four touchdowns for us tonight. That was the final play of the game. I'm just gonna let the time run out right here. 330 passing yards from the Raiders, only 15 rushing yards. So Philip Rivers, 16 of 19 for 296 yards. Did have an interception all on me. Derek Carr goes 25 of 43, 344 passing yards, but I'm going to put up the points. Taylor gets 124 rushing yards. Receiving wise, Hunter Renfro, the reception leader in this game, six receptions for 96 yards. Jacobs had five for 28. T.Y. Hilton led us in yards for the Colts with a 123. Henry Ruggs had 78 on three catches. What a beast.
in the sack department max crosby two darius leonard and houston had one rocky sin and kenny moore both had interceptions for us. jonathan taylor gets an upgrade things you love to see upgrade is elusiveness it's three upgrades change of direction speed and spin move that is awesome that's what we needed out of him all three upgrades are pretty good rodrigo we're gonna go with the power it's plus three to his awareness nice congrats on that Clinton Nelson gets a boost. It's going to upgrade him to a 96. Pass two to pass block, power, one to run block. He gets another speed boost? What? This dude speeds a 66 at a guard. Grace McSorley. Look at this. He's a 54 overall. I'm going to have to upgrade something here strong arm he gets plus three to his throw mid we got a weekly award jonathan taylor with his four rushing touchdowns 52 receiving yards he had a total of 176 yards in the last game eli apple kind of funny to see him there for the nfc this is our second time playing the texans in three weeks we lost the last game we will see how we do in the next one.